Pelvic reconstructive surgery is essentially a field that deals with uh, the lower urinary tract, primarily the, the ureters, the bladder, and the urethra in men and women. And for my specialty, it has less to do with uh, removing things from the body and more about putting things back uh, and restoring their function. This is a place that people come when they're told that what they have can't be fixed, um, this is where they come. And I think across the board, uh, this is the kind of place that says, I think we can. And, uh, and most of the time that turns out to be true. Johns Hopkins is, is that kind of place. And it's one of the things that, uh, you know, as I get emails uh, through the week about various things and folks will say, I've seen 10 other people and there doesn't seem to be an answer to my problem where they said it, it can't be done. And we say, well, come on down and, and let's see. Let's see if it, if it can't be done. And I think more often than not, there are solutions to those problems. And it's, uh, again, borrows from all the, the resources uh, that Johns Hopkins has to offer uh, and that our department uh, really represents kind of the, the, the highest level of, of urologic care that I think that we've ever seen. I'm Jamie Wright. Director of Reconstructive and Neurourology at the Brady Urological Institute and Chief of Urology at the Johns Hopkins Bayview Medical Center here at the Johns Hopkins School of Medicine.